Oh hey, what's up guys and welcome back to another video. And for today's detail, we're working in a two th And don't worry because this is a mom's daily driver, so you already know how it's on the interior. Before we're starting with it, make sure to, to be a 2013. thousand years later well hey what's up guys and welcome back to another video and for today's detail we have a 2013 Volkswagen Jetta and it's only for an interior detail but don't worry because this is a mom's daily driver and she has a little baby and you can really smell that too but before starting with the video make sure to be subscribed to the channel if you don't want to miss any future videos like this now, so click on the notification bell so you get notified whenever I upload a video. And also, if you want to see any sneak peeks, behind the scenes, or just any satisfying videos, make sure to go follow me on my Instagram. And now, let's get detailing. Hey, what's up everyone and just wanted to say hi to y'all because it just feels like it's been forever since I did a voiceover but now going into the detail as you guys can see the first step would be to take out any trash formats or any personal items but the owner was kind enough to get all the trash all the garbage out so it was really easy for me to start this detail to the vacuuming step And don't worry, as I will show all the vacuuming shots, as I just wanted to show you guys a transition from dirty to clean. And as you guys can see, I was able to get most of the carpet clean from the first pass, or at least what you can see more on the surface. But here's where this attachment really helps a lot as it gets everything from deep into the fibers out and gets it out in one pass. And then you just give another pass with the vacuum and you have a clean carpet and ready to extract it. And as I'm vacuuming the carpets, I also vacuum the seats and especially like this one that had a lot of debris in between the divisions. You gotta make sure to spread them so you can get everything out.
and now starting with the door panels and i always use a detailing brush and all-purpose cleaner and my microfiber towel to clean everything from the interior and that's just a combo that i really like to use even though they were not as sturdy but they get the job done and i always like to do it that way And if you guys are interested in any of the products that I use, like that drill brush attachment when I was vacuuming or this detailing brush, make sure to go check out the links on the description down below. And just like the rest on the interior and especially on the front panels, I always make sure to use my detailing brush so I can get into all the cracks and crevices and don't leave anything dirty in between them.
And now using a leather cleaner and my favorite brush from Color Lock, I always make sure to go in between the lines or the visions so I can have everything clean and get all that debris out and have a clean and shiny seat. And right before you guys watch this extraction shots, make sure to go hit that like button for me.
and now and now finally after all those extractions it's now time to protect all the interior with the uv protectant and not only that but it also looks just amazing when you put it all all over the interior And we can't forget about conditioning all the leather seats as it really helps and just brings them back to life and not only that but protects them from the UV rays and also prevents fading and cracking. Alright and we've reached the end of this video and I just want to thank every single one of you guys for leaving all those nice comments and staying tuned with the videos. So I really hope you guys enjoy this one here and make sure to leave a comment, a like and don't forget to subscribe to the channel and I'll see you guys on the next one.